Assalamualaikum and hi everyone. I am Najali, animal science student. In this video, I will talk about animal welfare. Before that, do you know what is animal welfare? Animal welfare refers to the state of the animal, the treatment that an animal receives in terms of animal care, animal husbandry, and human treatments. Protecting an animal welfare means providing for its physical and mental needs. There are five freedoms that describe animal welfare. Freedom from hunger and thirst, freedom from discomfort, freedom from pain, injury or disease, freedom to express normal behavior and lastly is freedom from fear and distress. Animals play many important roles in human life. They are a source of food, but do you know where they come from? Do you know animal might have suffered from your food? In this video, I will be showing you just how some farm animals are being treated. So, let's go. Huge quantity of animal product worldwide come from intensive livestock farming system. Intensive means that there are a lot of animal in this system. There, are, there is a large quantity of food and a large number of animals. But some of the intensive system, the animal are put in a very small space. This is a footage where they put many animals on a little space as possible because they can maximize production output while minimizing cost. Other than that, if the animal were put in the small space, the disease spread much faster. Now, in order to avoid the disease, the animal must heavily vaccinated. Then, do you have ever wondered what happened in store when no one seems to be looking? Animal rights organizations have secretly filmed activities that show animals are treated worse than you could imagine. This video shows employees at a daily milk farm in the US mistreating cows and calves. The newborn babies, they are so incredibly brutalized, not once a day, not twice a day, but all day long. The cows being ripped from their mother and three the hatches being left in extreme temperature, dying from dose temperature. But after this video is passed to the authorities, several action is taken but in some countries, there are no animal welfare laws. Lastly, we need to protect animal welfare because it is important to meet production because Poor animal welfare associated with poor animal production or health. And consumer concerns may influence market access. Good welfare can be enhanced primarily by providing good management. So, please don't abuse animal and protect its welfare. That's all for today. Thank you.